Hey YouTube, my name is Dan and this is a short free extract of my longer course called Animated Infographics and Data Visualization. That course along with the free exercise files for this particular video and a free downloadable cheat sheet can be found at bringyourownlaptop.com. Okay, in this video, we're gonna bring in a background image and lock it, it's gonna be easy. Let's go do it. Okay, so weird feature of After Effects, we talked about it before, if I make a new comp and I pick a color, okay, it doesn't really matter when I export it, it goes black. It's just there as a backing color. Okay, so we're gonna turn ours back to black and click on it, go back to black. Okay, because that's most of comps start life like. And if I wanna put in a colored background, Okay, we put in just a big rectangle. Now we could draw it, okay, but it's easier just to go to layer, new, and there's one called solid. Okay, click on solid. I'm gonna call this my background, background color. Okay, and it's gonna match the height and width of my video, great, everything's perfect. Pick a color, okay, any color, any color you like. Click okay, now when I export it, it's going to be green in the background. What I wanna do is not move it around, so I'm gonna lock it. Awesome, that's how to put a background color in. So I'm gonna bin that color, sorry. Okay, we just made it, but we're gonna bring in an image. So I'm gonna double click anywhere in this gray area. Then I'm gonna to go to infographic exercise files. I'm gonna to go to icon pop, it's the first one. There's one they called background. Okay, we're gonna bring it in, put it into my files. There it is, yep. Okay, and then I'm gonna drag him on to here. Now he's too big. Okay, so you can, like a lot of programs, you can kind of zoom out. Okay, I'm using the wheel of my mouse, but you can use command plus and minus if you're on a Mac or control plus and minus on a PC. And um, what you'll find though is you can grab the edges and it's fine, but weirdly, that's true of lots of Adobe products, but down here, there's one in here called transform and scale. Okay, you can just drag it down. I don't know why, but it is easier, okay, to use this, these controls down the bottom here, especially when you get multiple layers. Okay, so I'm gonna twirl that back up, up to you. So I'm gonna lock that layer, boom, background image. I just dropped the lightness of this in Photoshop. We'll do it later on in After XSLs using one of the effects. Easy, so we've got our background in. Next video, please. Hey there, what'd you think? If you liked the video, hit the like button, that'd be great. Uh, also consider subscribing to my channel. Now this is a free part of a longer course. You can check that out on bringyourownlaptop.com. On that site is a free downloadable printable PDF cheat sheet, okay, to help you with your infographics and data visualization. Uh, also on that site is a bunch of other courses as well. So go check it out, bringyourownlaptop.com. Bye now.